My name is Nandi Diabate. I'm from Abidjan. I'm an illustrator and 2D animator. I am Aristide Kwaku, a Fauverbi student, and I am a 3D model. I am Banyo Moussa, student in VFX. I'm Ashin Jaja. I'm an editor and 3D modeler. Josie is a slang word in Nochi, meaning little bird, often very hard jobs. They are called Joseph. They are too often considered second class citizen, but to has and many others. They are true average superheroes who fight for their livelihood with dignity and hope. So, what is Jossi Heroes? Jossi Heroes is a 15 minute short documentary, film mixing, and live action VFX. 2D and 3D animation to highlight the daily struggle of these brave men and women. Just the heroes are distinctive with the tools that they use to, to do their work in the street. According to our characters, uh, work and personalities, we will twist these tools and that usually represent their struggle into a symbol of pride and power. American female heroes characteristic in stereotype in time of law and identify some traditional authentic African attire, identify a specific African look and body type we want to work with. A classic female superheroes uh, identify traditional African attire in Ghana, Nigeria, and South Africa. Our main film character, Salimata, a key watcher bender, super rose look. We kept Salimata body type. We, we borrowed from a Malinke culture to build a look egg, dresses, accessories, color. We went to the street of Abidjan looking for Joseph and meet Salimata who sells water. After she agreed to be part of our project, we worked on her character design. We decided that Salimata's super ego alter ego would be Waterbender. Once we found our superhero, Salimata, we proceeded to start shooting the live action. We modeled a 3D basin. Just like the one she carries water with, as we wanted to use it as a superhero accessory and add the visual effect to the full scene. We added 2D animation to allow our superheroes to go beyond their human limits. Our goal with this is to remain original and add light to the African identity of the everyday people that we ensued to two D superheroes. Looking for other Josser. The other profiles were firstly Sana Abdul Razak aka Metallico, a young mecha mechanic of twenty one years old, in spite of his handicap, he never gave up his dream. Today he is a team leader to his colleagues. Sana's superpower is courage. Secondly, Simpore Isaka, aka the artist, a 31 years old manufacturer of plastic basket, all manually with his hand. It is an activity that is very hard on the hand because the material used is very difficult to handle. His superpower is happiness. And to end, so Amadou aka Hot Spot, an itinerant coffee seller who travel miles on foot with his coffee cut to sell. So is a person who works with great hope. When asked if he would be tempted to go to Europe illegally, he answered it. Personally, no. I prefer to fight for my livelihood and to succeed her in my birth country. So, Sapapawai is ambition.
Jersey Heroes is a family friendly film documentary with an appeal for all their teens and adults. Why does our project need to be funded? To be honest, when we embark on the Sun Talent League project, we thought that our first challenge was to make a beautiful, original, and strong piece of work. But during the nine weeks of discussion with our mentors and the other teams, we realized the universal dimensions of our characters and the importance of showcasing them. Characters was journey and determination in body and image of Africa that the world know too little about. This film must exist, and our hope is that it circulates and impacts the whole world because it reminds that we all have raising us the reason to believe that our lives can change. That the last thing we can ever lose is up. As artists, we are looking for the film to travel around the world in, festi in film festival. It is a tribute film, a message film, a strong film. His everyday characters are real superheroes, Jossie heroes. Thank you. Je <coughs> Benandin,